Sonia Seibert, Great Basin College, Vice President for Business Affairs. Uh, Ms. Seibert, do you know how much money Great Basin College will be receiving from the latest stimulus package? For the, from the third stimulus package, we are estimated to receive about $2.3 million, with $1.3 million going directly to students in emergency aid, and the rest is to support the institution. Fantastic. Um, is that amount uh, more or less than you think is needed for the situation? Well, currently we are facing a 12% budget reduction for the net upcoming biennium, which is about $1.6 million for mm -hmm. each year. So it won't um, cover that deficit, but it will help. Okay. Um, can you tell us how Great Basin College mostly spent the funds for the prior stimulus package? For both um, Stimulus Package 1 and Stimulus Package 2, all institutions of higher education had to dedicate a specific portion to um, student emergency aid. Those it, grants went directly to the students, and that was about $235,000 each round that went directly to students. The other portion was provided um, us to maintain our budget reductions um, to offset the lost revenue. For FY21, we received a 19% budget cut through the 31st special session of the legislature this summer, which amounted to $2.6 million for GBC. And so we're offsetting our lost revenue with the, those institutional funds, allowing us to cover payroll expenses and technology-related expenses. Final question, uh, what are you hoping will be accomplished with this year regarding impacts from COVID-19? I'm hoping that the economy will rebound, not only in the state of Nevada, but also throughout the world. Community colleges play a large part in workforce development and training, and Great Basin College is poised to play an important and key role in getting Nevadans back to work in the new um, norm.